Avengers Endgame is easily the most awaited movie of 2019, and because of that, it's game time. Anyway, this is RJ, and today I'm going to give you a quick unboxing, a quick review, and the reason why I'm selling this after one day of use. So the box itself is uh, pure Marvel and Adidas. You'll see a lot of Avengers characters in here, in here, in here, in here, I mean everywhere. It's pure Marvel. So here is the Zane 5 Black Panther. Looks dope, looks good. There's a 500 pesos difference uh, over the original Zane 5. Zane 5 is 6,000 pesos SRP. This one is 6,500 pesos. So you basically add 500 pesos for this limited edition Zane 5. So what's the most obvious difference uh, between the original Zane 5 and the Zane 5 Black Panther? Obviously it's the design. The shade here, the shade there, I mean everywhere. Purple and black. On top of that, the logo of Damian Lillard here. And the logo of Black Panther here. They are made out of, uh, I guess this is stainless steel. Compared to the original Zane 5, it's only printed uh, paint, rubber paint. Why am I selling this gorgeous shoe after one day of use? First things first, I love the performance of the shoe. But the reason uh, I'm selling this is because I'm a white footer and it doesn't look good on me. If you want a shoe, the shoe uh, might fit you or might not. And when it fits you, it might not look good on you. But when I use it off the court like a casual shoe, it doesn't look good on me. It looks like I'm McDonald's. Big shoe, wide shoe, a sense it's going to explode. In short, it doesn't look good on me. So I decided to sell it uh, so that maybe someone who is not a white footer like me and enjoy this Black Panther uh, Day 5. So that's it guys. Uh, it's name time.